Hey guys, I'm Dwayne Soap here. Welcome back to the channel. And today, Apple releasing iOS 14.4.1 alongside iPadOS 14.4.1 and WatchOS 7.3. Point two. Yes, Apple today released a software update or a minor software update, which is very, very important. And I'll dig into the details here in just a few seconds. Now, keep in mind, this software is not running any beta. This is an official software release. So you can head on over to settings in general and software updates, and you can update your iPhone right now to 14.4.1. This is, again, a minor update with important security improvements. And we'll go over the details. The build number here, 18D. Six, one. Now, there's rumored that Apple is soon to be releasing iOS 14.5 here in the next couple of weeks, about two and a half weeks or so. So this uh, software update is actually must be very, very important if Apple is just releasing right now, right before 14.5. It means this cannot wait. Now, this software, as I mentioned, is available for iPhone iPads, as well as the watch OS is available for the watch. And there's also a Mac OS version update as well. Now, according to Apple's release notes, now Apple usually does not disclose the, the uh, gravity or the issue with the vulnerability within a software patch when it comes to security improvements, but it looks like this one has to do with the WebKit. So Apple has updated all their platforms pretty much Mac OS, iPad OS, iOS, and watch OS for this vulnerability. So if you want your iPhone, of course, to stay with the latest software updates and security patches this one is recommended for all users now if you're running in the latest beta on another iPhone 14.5 keep in mind Apple will most likely release this patch here soon for beta testers as well so if you're running iOS 14.5 beta then Apple will release a patch here shortly so we can expect another beta for iOS 14.5 to include the patches released today with watchOS 7.3.2 iOS and iPadOS 14.4 Point one. And this is just a very quick update, but keep in mind, guys, it is important for you to update your iOS device. If you're not looking to jailbreak or anything like that, it's always good to have the latest security patches. There's a reason why Apple released this very quick update here without any beta testing, and this needs to be patched. Now, keep in mind, we're expecting iOS 14.5, maybe on the week of the 22nd or towards the end of the week of the 29th of March, depending on when Apple decides to hold their event this year. Some of the leaks claim that this event will be held on the 23rd of March this year to release AirTags alongside other Apple products during the pipeline with the new software update 14.5. But 14.4.1, definitely one that you want to update. You don't want to spend two and a half weeks without this security patch. And there you guys have it. Again, you can update your Apple Watch, your iPads, or your iPhone right now. No beta testing. Thank you for watching this quick one and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.